it's Gav here from DartsPlanet.tv and again we have another jam-packed weekend of darts. This weekend it is at the Minehead Resort at Butlands for the um, Players' Championships final sponsored by Mr Green. I'm looking forward to it. Obviously we've got a lot of players in this one. There's two stages, um, 64 players. We see one stage obviously live on telly, the other one is streamed. So I love everything about this format. As fast as first, you've got the 64 awesome players in it. Um, but I don't want to bore you to death, but I know a lot of you have asked for my predictions. I don't know why, I do not know why, but I wanted to give them the best I can. You'll have to excuse me with some of the names as well, because some of the players I'm not mega familiar with, because obviously we don't get to see them on telly all the time. So if I'm announcing them wrong, Hands up right from the start. Yes, it's it's just me. I'm like that. I often get words and that wrong. But I'm going to run through the different um, predictions here. So it starts today at 12.45. So first of all, I want to go through the um, afternoon session on the main stage. So we've got, we'll start, we're kicking off the afternoon with Darren Webster against Altenio, Antonio, Antonio Alcinis. Darren Webster, I think, is going to win this one 6-3. Then we go to the form, Robert Thornton. He's got his match up against James Richardson. I think the form will come through this one 6-2. Cullen versus Caden was a bit quite difficult for me, um, but I think Cullen's a great floor player, and I think he'll win this one 6-4. Then we've got Chizzy Chisnell against Joe Mernon. Chizzy, we all know how dangerous he is. I can't see any other winner here. I think he'll get through this one easy. 6-2. Then we've got Stephen Bunton, the bullet against Benito van der Paz. Stephen Bunton has been playing so much better lately. Um, on the up. Uh, so I think he's going to win this one. Go through to the next round. 6-4. Kim Hybrex is next against Chris Doby. Hybrex, always funny. You know, never know which Hybrex is going to turn up. But I think love too much in a tight game. But he will win this one. 6-5. Then we've got Adrian Lewis. He's, got, he's defending huge amounts of money at the moment. He needs to get something here because he needs to stay in the world's elite. If he don't do well here at the um, Ali Pali, he's going to find himself out of the top 16. But I think he's going to win this one 6-1. So that's the afternoon session on the main stage. After that, we've got, at the same time happening on stage two, um, we have got Steve Lennon against Zorin uh, Lach... Uh, Lennon don't say that word, but I'm going to go for Steve Lennon. He will win this one. 6-3. Then we've got Justin Pipe against Marks Webster. Justin Pipe's so up and down at the moment. Um, I think Webster will come through this one. 6-3. Then we've got Richard North against Pete Hudson. Very difficult one to decide on this one, but I'm putting North to win this one against Hudson. 6-5. Then we've got Mervyn King, the King, against Brendan Dolan. I think Mervyn will have too much firepower. Brendan's on the way down at the moment. He'll win this one, 6-3. Then we go to Steve Beaton against Ronnie Hybrix. Uh, Steve Beaton, a great floor player. Been about for years. Very consistent. Ronnie, I don't think he'll beat this. I don't think he'll beat Beaton a bit. But I think that Steve Beaton will come through this one, 6-4. Steve West against Ryan Seals, very difficult one. Ryan always seems to do very well in this competition in previous years. But I think Steve West will win this one, 6-5. Then we've got Jermaine against Keegan Brown. Uh, I'm going for Keegan Brown to win this. I like everything about him. I think he's got flair, I think he's got passion, and he loves the game. He just needs to get back to where he was a few years ago. But I think he'll win this one, 6-4. Next we've got um, Peter Jacks against Chris O'Reyes. I think that Chris O'Reyes will win this one, 6-4. Then we've got Wade. It's nice to see Painter back. It's nice to see Wade. Um, Paint. Hopefully I can see him on the live stream or something. But I think that James Wade will win this one 6-3. So they're my afternoon sessions. They're my predictions. Go and bet your life on it. No, don't do that because they'll probably be wrong and I'm just messing about here. But they're my predictions. But I'm now going to move on to the evening ones. I don't want to keep this video too long because I don't want to bore you guys to death. I know how painful it can be sometimes. But I know that some of you want them. So I'm going to go into the evening session now. So the evening session kicks off at 7pm. And on the main stage, it starts off with Ian White against Raymond Van Barneveld. I think that Barney will beat White 6-3. Mensa Solovich, one of my favourite players. Love him or hate him, I think he's great. He's going to beat Bolton 6-2. Rob Cross, awesome at the moment. Seems to destroy anybody. Got the right mentality. He's brilliant. He's going to beat Robert Owen 6-zip. Can't see him getting a can't see him getting a leg. Daryl Gurney, again, he's got Jeffrey Deswan. We know how good Jeffrey can be, but Gurney at the moment is on form. He'll win this one 6-2. Then we've got Gary Anderson against Mickey Mansell. Gary Anderson, unbelievable player, heavy scorer. He'll win this one 6-0. Then 
MVG against Paul Nixon. Great to see the asset back. Missed him. I think he's a great player. It'd be great to see him back on the main stage. He's still got it. But MVG, far a power for anybody. I can't see Nicholson getting a leg. MVG will win this one 6 0. Then we've got Peter Wright against Steve Hines. Sorry, I had to turn there because my where I'm reading them from slipped down, so it just shows that I've got a bit of an error here. But Peter Wright, I think he will win this one against Steve Hines 6 2. We then go on at the same time into the evening session. And this is on stage two. And we've got the Wizard Whitlock. He's up against Kist. I feel so sorry for Kist. He really struggled in his last game out. I know he suffered from, you know, arthritis and different things. But Whitlock's going to have too much firepower here. Kist is going to win 6-1. Iceman Gerwin Price against Jimi Hendrix. Um, Gerwin Price will win this one 6-2. James Wilson against William O'Connor. I think James Wilson is going to, a bit more TV experience, is going to win in this one 6-4. John Henderson, big bad John. He's going to beat Darren Johnson, 6-4. Vincent van der Voort against Robbie Green is a tough one for me to call, but I think that Robbie Green's just got the edge on this one. He'll come through this one, 6-4. Then we've got Johnny Clayton against Jeffrey DeGraff. Uh, Johnny Clayton, really like the guy. Think he'll do well. Won, won our, obviously, our championship this year. I think that he will win this one, 6-4. Carl Anderson, great player. Love everything about him. Great for darts. Think he'll beat Ron Millukamp, 6-3. Then we've got Michael Smith. Bully Boy against Jan Decker. Jan Decker never seems to do that great. The, bullet bo the Bully Boy will have too much and he'll win this one 6-2. Then we finish off the day with Alan Norris against Yellow Klassen. Yellow Klassen um, is a player that I like very much. I think Norris is great too, but I think that Norris will win this one 6-4. So there you have it, guys. I'm going to wrap this video up. I know it's really long. If you like... Um, my videos and want to keep up to date with some of the cool stuff that we're coming out please subscribe leave a like and share I've just launched an awesome channel where you can watch all your darts at your fingertips called dartsplanet.tv thank you for watching me it's been a pleasure as always and I'll catch you in the next video